So the question is whether Na2SO4 is acetic, basic, or neutral in water. And that's important. It's dissolved in water. So to figure that out, what we need to do is figure out how this Na2SO4, this sodium sulfate, was made. So to get sodium sulfate, you react sulfuric acid plus sodium hydroxide. And here's your salt, and you get a water. This is a neutralization reaction. And we have these rules here. If we know whether it's a strong acid or a strong base, the combination of these two, we can figure out what the pH of this substance will be. So let's take a look at this chart here. And we can see H2SO4, sulfuric acid here, that's a strong acid. So this is a strong acid. Sodium hydroxide right here, it's a strong base. So we have a strong acid and a strong base. When we have a strong acid and a strong base, that means that we'll end up with a neutral pH, pH about 7. So when we're asked whether Na2SO4 is acetic, basic, or neutral in water, it's going to be neutral. That's because we have a strong acid here with the H2SO4, and then the NaOH, that's a strong base. This is Dr. B, and thanks for watching.